Yo, so guys, today we're going to play Soror Chaos. Um, yeah, I'm not very sure what to pick, uh, all pick or random, probably gonna pick random, because every time I go all pick, I don't really know what to pick myself, so I end up going for some meme threads, such as like a Knight of Uproot Barracks or Sorok Uproot Barracks. And I feel like they're not very healthy for my mindset, because they are promoting this idea of like um, destroying the enemies um, early, you know and then suffering later myself like the suffering is not very healthy that's what i was about to say so we're gonna probably go for the all random stra all random races um yeah i i, I kind of want to play uh something that i don't usually play some race that oh my god oh my god is this really happening <laughs> is this really happening <clears throat> okay I guess it is happening. Oh well. Oh well. Well, that was very fast, yeah. That was very fast. Some people might think I even in this now. <laughs> Map editor smooth for like a hacker. Oh boy. So this thing has an um, inspiration aura. Pretty short range, but yeah, buffs the units. It benefits from the upgrades on damage that benefit the units as well. Oh man. I say benefits from the upgrades, yeah. This one, right? Cheater. What do you mean by that? I feel like he never seen a uh, uprooted barracks thread before. He never seen an uprooted barracks thread before. Uh, I expect the red to react uh, wisely and probably upgrade the barrack and do some wise stuff. Unlike blue, who's probably not gonna do much, you know. Spikes would also help a lot, I think, so, yeah. I have a minus one. I hope people can toler tolerate it better, like uh, other players. But yeah, I don't know, man. Really depends. Okay, yeah, Red, Red reacted uh, super wise. He upgraded the barrack, that's what I would do. So, first thing in the game, upgrade the barrack. Uh, next thing I would probably um, just start upgrading the damage. Yeah, that's what he's doing. I thought about towers, but like they have here yeah, pierce damage. Pierce damage is literally the worst, so it's not that good. It's not that good to be honest. I have a few ways of playing that. Um, yeah, probably should do this. Come on, do it in time. Nice gonna give me the gold as well, so I need it. Like, it's very hard for an enemy to get a uh, tier 3, right? Early. So my tier 2 gonna be dominating the mid. Just need to get extra armor upgrade for that dinosaur right there. Chaos damage towers by blue and upgrades on them are also very wise. Like, blue can deal with my my stuff way better than red. If he stayed in the game, he might have actually killed it without losing a barrack. Oh, surprisingly, uh, red is actually doing that. So that actually might happen. He's summoning a lot of units to deal with my, with my barrack. I don't know if it's gonna be any worth, but yeah, we'll see, we'll see about that. Hmm. 
Let's get a caster rocket as well. Let's just try to get a good development. I know how green lost a barrack to a liver blue. That doesn't make any sense to me either. Um, yeah, that's a bit weird. What do you mean was AFK? What the fuck does that supposed to mean? <laughs> if you upgrade your barrack. Alright, this is fine. This is fine, at least I took the barrack and I made him use a lot of units. I kinda wanna upgrade these right now because I have gold for it. See, Red, Red understands it, or at least he tries to be cocky, I know, we'll see about that. Alright, I kinda wanna upgrade, yeah, I, I'm trying to upgrade the mercenary right now. Um, probably gonna do double mercenary upgrade, then do triple upgrade on the range damage and try to pick up the tier 4 upgrade on mid. I need to dominate mid like uh, pretty significantly, you know. I'm dominating on upgrades like they're pretty far, they can't catch up yet, so yeah. It's a pretty good idea to just focus on that. Unfortunately, I, I feel like I stopped getting gold for my barracks. So that is pretty bad, but yeah, nothing I can do about it, fortunately, so it's fine. I really need to pressure green now, on the middle. I really need to do that. As much as I can. Yeah, so I have like a, a middle that is farming me a lot of cash. I have a relatively early double masonry upgrade. I have all my tier 1 upgrades out as well. So the moment I get a tier 4, I feel like I'm gonna be pretty strong, you know. Like I'm gonna become relatively strong after that. Need to kill the siege torrent first. There goes my wave. He doesn't have masonry yet. So we have a better economy than green. Made an archimage on middle. Yeah, on, on the right side. So he is getting pressured a lot. By left side. Okay. Interesting. These are shock waves. Yeah, that's okay. Not much I can do about him using his defense abilities, right? So, okay, idea now is to chill out. Uh, basically, tag, get double masonry. Um. Yeah, attack, get double masonry. Get probably the second caster upgrade. Uh, and start upgrading the damage more. So something like that, yeah. I know where the Archimage is going to go. I might, I might actually also do instead uh, upgrade 
myself to tier 2 and send a hero. That might be also a possibility. An Uther. So he sends a double hero on me, or what? Or he defends himself against me. Against blue. Yeah, I feel like he is defending against blue. It's not on mid, yeah. Otherwise he would appear already. No! There's the Uther, yeah. He actually sent the Uther on mid. Right, then I'm really considering sending a hero myself. On the middle. Let's check out GPM. I actually don't have the highest GPM, yeah. Green has pretty high GPM too. But he, he wasted on double heroes and he's uh oh he's not behind on upgrades, he's getting damage now. He has still a tier 2 barrack. Still has a tier 2 barrack. I really wonder what my auras are. Maybe I can get some cool auras. Let's find out. Also, I wish I, I could send a, a unit to capture the neutral buildings on the left side. Just some weird way. But there is not really any way. I can actually a siege unit capture them. I just like, I, I don't know. I really wonder. I really wonder myself. If that is the case. Green is actually pushing me, which is really good. Really, really good. Yeah, that's uh, very, very good for me. So now if I send a hero... Yeah, that will be amazing. It will be just straight amazing. I really want to summon a hero before using the spells, so that would be ideal for me. Summon another hero. I could have finished them fast then. Actually, I feel like I panicked too much. I feel like I panicked too much. I should have not done that. But that's okay. Okay. Uh, what should I get? Like, really? Yeah, I'm not sure myself. Okay, uh, so green gave up. Then we're just pushing red, I guess. Like, where where is our middle is going to now? Where is our middle is going to now? I wonder myself. Like, I don't know if I can afford all these upgrades, you know. Hmm, <laughs> with this. I feel like I should get poison, like poison is pretty good against the heroes. And like, now it's gonna be a hero battle. But maybe, um, maybe the killing spree would be better. Would have been better. Ah, let's save up for a, for a tier 3 and super unit. Why my hero is going there? Are you dumb? Oh my fucking god. Yeah, my hero just went. What a dumbass.
Oh, he is out of mana. But he's not summoning any heroes, huh? Maybe a Russian ultimate weapon. Yeah, I feel like Russian ultimate weapon right now would be amazing for me. Don't you think? Like, I know, I feel like I, there are not a single passive that I really should consider right now. Because I, I can't afford, like, all of them. Oh, the guy is smart. Yeah, he upgraded the barrack. And he has Kodos as well. It's pretty sorted. That's pretty sorted. Zero upgrades on armor. Zero upgrades on casters. Three upgrades on range and two upgrades on melee. Huh. Okay. <laughs> yeah, that's a bit weird, but alright. So, that is my 4th upgrade on damage. Man, if only my hero went the right way, I feel like this barrack would be a gunner. That's a pretty sad... ...thing to happen. That's just a lot of uh, units right there, by the way. Like, really a lot of them. I wonder if I'm gonna be okay even. Maybe Sphere Aura. It's really scary. I might do a triple hero push, but I don't know if I will finish him, so it's like a big question mark by me, whether it's going to work or not. Just gonna continue the development. Yeah, I need like 6 upgrades on range, then upgrades on armor, then tech to tier 3. I just, I really wonder, like, can, can a turtle capture uh, a neutral building or not? I kinda, I kinda wanna test it on blue, if blue will ever push me. Because, like, red, yeah, red is a very bad example for that, you know. It's a very bad example. A lot of units by red, man. Like, this is a gajillion amount of units right there. I hope I will have my X spell by the time this wave will come. It's not getting any upgrades at all, like he has literally no armor upgrades and yet he is uh, winning against me. Yeah, I do have it, okay. Let's get an, an armor upgrade. <clears throat> Some of the hero, I wonder where. Probably on the bottom because blue is pushing him. I have a extra research speed, so yeah, I'm just very fast with my upgrades right now. Perhaps I should, yeah, I should get a bit of, um, maybe I don't rely on tier 3. Maybe I fight right now, right here, actually. Not very sure. You know what? Yeah, why not? Why not? Cheap upgrade as well. Mm, I don't know which one, yeah. Oh, I can maybe afford one, yeah. I don't know which. No.
Yeah, because like I feel like I'm gonna need to use these. Like I'm, re I'm really gonna need to use these. So I need to get a good upgrade, you know. Let's get poison, probably. Yeah, poison probably is my best upgrade. Wait, is that all? Wait, what is the whole wave? What is the whole wave, dude? I feel like it's down there. <laughs> yeah, I feel like not the whole wave appeared. So that's why... I'm killing it right now without having to use my spells. But yeah, that was kind of awkward. <laughs> yeah, so I just gave my hero plus two armor because of his rallying cry. Now he's a bit more powerful guy. It's good. Yeah, like, I know where the wave went to. Oh, because he's not pushing me directly, that's why. It went to, like, uh, yeah, it went to blue. I'm so stupid, man. I forgot that it doesn't go to me directly, it goes to blue. <laughs> True. Fuck. But you can summon a hero. To the middle, why? Thinks he can beat me. Like that's a bit. Yeah, I, I understand how he he's playing without any upgrades. Maybe he's rushing tier three. Not very sure. I have the poison, so this hero has minus five percent attack rate and six damage per second. Could have upgraded it. It affects even the super units, right? Yeah, it affects everyone the super units. I don't know, maybe I should rush tier 3, like I'm trying to right now. What was he thinking when he sent it? And how blue actually ended up being on mid? Oh, because he pushed him, yeah, true. So blue defended against his wave. That's admirable. We have 600 mana. We can actually shoot an ultimate weapon twice now. So there goes that. For some reason this guy looks like a tryhard who would actually rage a lot about losing. So if you're gonna make him lose, I feel like you're gonna have a lot of compromises and a lot of excuses, a lot of salt. I admit I play like a very dirty strat and there is no skill behind it, but I mean... Yeah, it's still fun, you know, to mess up with people a little bit. Oh, he finally pushed the uh, blues. Blue space. Okay, does he have enough mana to cast a spell? That's the question. Yes. Yes, he does. Okay, can we get the uh, regeneration of HP? And he will survive. For masonry. I see. Redirecting the hits, I think. My hero died. Can is going to regenerate now. Yep. The barrack is gone. But he still has this barrack, so. I'm still under the threat. Still under a big threat. Yeah, blue is coming, so... I mean, blue is gone, now he's coming through the bottom to me. That's pretty scary. Because I have tier 1 barrack on that side. 
They have Louis gun now. So Hester too. Now he's taking. I doubt he has um, ultimate weapon. So I hope I'm going to be I'm going to be fine. Yep, the wave is coming. <laughs> Tearful barrack wave. <laughs> really, really scary, man. I need them to attack my main, ideally. So my hero will aggro 100%. Oh, yeah, I can. Yeah, what did I destroy that he fed me so much? Yeah, so now I have super unit, it's either going to go on mid or it's going to go on the left side. I'm pretty, I'm pretty happy with both ways. You know, I'm pretty happy with it going either of the ways, so... Like, I'm very surprised how he is holding with zero upgrades on armor, to be honest. I have... I don't understand it. I literally don't. Oh yeah, let's just send him more heroes. Let's make it one big push and also shoot an ultimate weapon above that. It's gonna go for the base trade real fast. Okay. Let's see if he has a protection against that, probably he doesn't. Yeah, and I think we won the game. Well, the guy wasn't salty about it, he just, like, he saw that strat for the first time, probably. And he was like, maybe surprised, maybe he got some notes down or something. Go shit, yeah, go shit. Um, I know, I feel like I played it to my best ability. Like, there is nothing really to improve. I, I master it every time, like, I play it more. So, like, pushing more upgrades is definitely the way. I don't know why he didn't go for the upgrades that much like an armor and, and so on, but yeah, like me having 77 upgrades, tier 4 mid, pushing the heroes, pushing the ultimate weapon, minute 27, it's pretty, really, really early, really, really early. Uh, I feel like Masonry also pays like a big price in it, you know? So yeah, GP guys, hope you enjoyed it, and i see you in the next one. Peace!